Good morning, friends. I once again welcome you on Mangesh Mathematical Trading. Today is 12th of January. Time is 9 minutes past 11. 11.09 AM. Let's see how market Nifty, Bank Nifty, Fin Nifty, you know, unfolded today. How trades could have been taken. So let's start with Bank Nifty. Okay. Sorry, let's start with Nifty. Now, as you, you could say, this is the first 5-minute Nifty candle. You can see the timing. Started at 9.15, closed at 9.20. You see the closest, 21,733. So the closest price, strike price was 21,750. We consider 21,750 call and 21,750 put. First of all, we uh, mark the single premium price. Now, if you will ask me where do you get single premium price, then I will tell you daily I post on Telegram the single premium price. Okay, and you could see that single premium price for today was, see this, 121.15. So let me show you the single premium price was 121.15. We've seen this. This was posted at 9.13, even before the market started. <clears throat> now, having found a single premium price and having plotted them 121.15, you could, you could see the blue line, you know. And then my usual technique swapping. Okay, so you get one upper level, you get one lower level. And then simply see whenever one green candle closes above the upper level. Now just see this. This closes 133, but the value of upper line is 133.15. So we need to wait. Now here they have closed. 134.80 is the close of the call, which is above the upper line. And the close of the put is 121.60. You could see it over here, which is below the SPP. So now we have got a clear cut demarcation. See, whole through this point, SP was going up, going down. But here, conclusively, not only we found a candle, same candle, on which call has closed above SPP, put has closed below SPP, but also this call has closed above the higher black line, upper black line, and the put has closed below the lower black line. Now here there are two kinds of trade for first we wait till we get a, a red candle just like this which is not touching the line. But there is one more technique which we have developed that is known as square root technique. If you will see the close of put 12160 you just see this 12160 plus square root of 12160. If Above that, this is closed. Now, just get the square root of 121.6. Okay. And the square root of 121.6 is 11.02. I will add 121.60. And I get the fi final answer of 132.62. Now, this closed is greater than 132.62. So this candle has completed all the norms. It has closed above the upper line while the put candle, that's a green candle, while the put candle is a red candle and close below the lower line. The close of the green candle of call is greater than the close of red candle plus square root of it. The call has closed above the single premium price. The put has closed below the single premium price. Now see the timing. The timing is... 945. Now let us go on Nifty chart. See the importance of Nifty levels, which I post on a daily basis, is extraordinary. You see, on 945, what has happened? This is buy above level and this is sell below level, so which I post. Once again, so I will show you this. See now, buy above and sell below level over here. You see, today's buy above level was. 808 and sell below was 738. The same are marked over here. 808 and 738. Now, all through this 5-6 candles, the price is showing resilience at the sell below level. They are not going, they are not breaching the low of first 5-minute candle. And then at 945, it closed 
above this cell below level. It shows Nifty doesn't want to go down. That is confirmed by call, which has exactly at the same time 945. You see, it has closed above and or whatever narration I gave you, you know, earlier. So here it was confirmed. Nifty will go up. You buy one lot and then your target will be upper line 133.15 plus 26.11, which was 167.91. And the second one was 199. Both were hit. That's all. Now see what is the present scenario. Now the Nifty is at this level. But as I told you, we have to have two candlestick, two green candle pattern above the line. So this is the first candle signal candle price tried went up and tried to close above this candle but it didn't its low is 822.90 still you are not finding i mean it's still at that level if price close above this high nifty will go further or if candle closes below this low nifty will go down so it's always better if one is in a decent profit had you taken near 133 Already people have booked near 199. You see the difference from 132 to 199. Forget about this. Newcomers can buy profit at 167. Still see 67 and 33. It's a fair amount of profit. It's more than 25%. And that is what I say. 25% is possible in option. So that's it. Now let's go to Nifty Bank. See, precisely everything goes as per this at a 945, just like the Nifty. See, 945, just see. Bank Nifty also closed above sell below level. See the timing, 945. Let me show you Nifty also, 945. See. So but that, that is why I post, first I post the level. They are at most important. Merely on levels also one can trade. If some... Someone goes long at 47,500 or 47,600. They definitely will make money. Forget about swapping and this and that and target and square root. Forget it. You know, something goes, someone takes a risk. Why he will take a risk over here? His risk to reward ratio is highest. He knows a candle closing below this, he will trigger stop loss. Don't ever worry about stop loss in option. It's very, very meager. Provided you don't over trade. You don't... Trade over your capacity. Okay. So, merely on levels people are trading. Okay. But still, we are well equipped with some other resources like this. Now, this also. This was the upper line. This was the lower line. Now, just see. We waited. Exactly. Everyone. Now, here we got a late entry. Because use this close. 359.70 is the value of the upper line. And this is, this is close as 360. One has closed. Let me bring it in alignment. Okay. Now see one candle, green candle has closed above the upper line. One red candle has closed below the lower line. Call has, which has closed above the upper line. That has also closed above the SPP. This has closed below the SPP. Now see this. It's high plus, sorry. It's close plus square root of close 328 and 360. So this has given a, the square root has given a node. Plus at a 955, precisely at 955, you could see this candle coming up. So everything matches. You don't have any reason why you shouldn't buy. You don't have any reason why you shouldn't buy. So this, and that is why after completion of his, you bought. Then the first target calculation was 453 and the downside target was 252. Someone, see if someone would have shorted here, then this was the first target. What is the second target? Let me change the time frame and show you the second, the second target is still further. So it is, yeah, 539, 539.55 was the second target. It reached up to 518, somewhere between this. Okay. So, this is magnetic trades, simple. Okay. This is how it started. It went up, took support precisely, see at the target one, and now try to go back once again. At the same time, it closed at uh, 
it closed at this level. Now it's trying to go below 26.11. Okay, this was the second trade. Now let's go to Nifty Fin Service. Sip up, say, you know, so everything is the same. Pin Nifty is same. You see, this was the level of Pin Nifty. Let me show you Pin Nifty level. Pin Nifty level that, you know, see, I, I haven't posted, but this was the level of pairs, Pin Nifty 248. So you see, you need at least two candles lower close. I mentioned it yesterday on Telegram. This was the first candle. Of course, this is not even a first candle because this is touching the line. So ideally, the candle shouldn't touch the line. And then see nothing closed. The, see the timing 10. And then let's go on chart. Yeah, so this is it precisely 10. It is confirming all. This has closed above the upper line. Everything is confirmed. Now you will ask, someone will ask, sir, here also it had fulfilled all. Correct question. Now this has closed above the upper line. This has closed below the upper line. This has closed above the single premium price. This has closed below the single premium price. Why didn't you take call at this level? Again, I'm reiterating precisely for the same reason. We watch both the chart. In fact, three charts together, call, put and index. See the timing. The timing is 9.30. Now at 9.30, let me come back to the see now. This is 9.30. See, this is 9.30, 9.30. Still, I haven't found a clear-cut signal that this will go down. Always remember, if it has to cross down below, it will go fast. It will not loiter. It will not linger. You see here. So whosoever is active, you know, in this particular segment, he won't let you buy or sell, you know, say at this level. He simply, he will take it down. The more it loiters, the more it lingers, the more are the possibility of the reversal of pain. The more is the proper uh, the, the possibility of a reversal of pain. And it is still far away from the upper line. Upper line is far away. So it's better. So that is the reason, first of all, why a trade was not taken at this. Now, when a trade was taken over here, 10 a.m. candle, just see. This was the candle. It has categorically shown that I do not want to go down. That is why a trade is to be avoided. See, that is why you have to, it is just like a game of chess. You have to concentrate on, on a rook also, on a knight also, on queen also. There are many things. Here you have only three things. Call, put and index. Spot. So that has almost hit the first target. Almost. See, the first target was 179. And that's all. It came down. So we, today we saw all the three trades, how the trades could have been taken. These videos are shared only for the educational purpose. And that is why I never ever give any recommendations. Okay. These are purely educational. You try it out. This is a new mathematical approach. You just use your brains. You first work upon it, learn it with your own experience. That's all. If you want to know more about it, you can contact me 91673-54953. Uh, for calling for WhatsApp, I will once again read out my number 91673-54953. Thank you so much for watching. Have a nice day and have a nice weekend ahead.